Hey, Dan Meyer here and I'm back once again with another video for you. Today, we're talking about narratives. Um, kind of generally talking about just narratives and storytelling for small business owners. So if you are an entrepreneur and you're looking to grow your business or launch your business for the first time, you need to be thinking about narratives and not just any kind of narrative, but narratives that are data driven. So I call them data narratives and they're data centric stories that you talk about to your audience, to your potential clients, to your current clients, to your former clients, to your employees, to people that can influence for you, to people that you partner with or joint venture with. You want to be good at telling narratives. Basically, narratives are something that you need to do to, when you get in front of somebody to help explain what you do and why you do it. What is your goal? What is your vision? What is your mission? Who do you want to help? How do you decide if you're being effective or not? How do you influence people's decision making so they want to buy with you, partner with you, uh, do business with you, um, to work with you? Well, you have to build a narrative to kind of give them the context of who you are and what you do and why you should be the person they say yes to. So to do this, you have to do some very simple things. And a virtual assistant can help you do most of these things. Number one is you need good content, right? Content about who you are, your story, your background, content about your products, your services, what it is you do and why you're special at it. And kind of like testimonials, case studies, things that you've done that demonstrate why you're good at what you do and why you'd be good for somebody else who wants to work with you. So having this content creation, uh, taking these customer case studies, these customer stories, and building them into a narrative is really important. A virtual assistant can help you do that. They can edit the videos for you. They can design graphics for you. They can be able to help do the copy for you. They can help you edit it and get it out there. So all you have to focus on is telling people who you are, what you do, and why you do it. And that way you're not worried about all the technical things that go on with creating a narrative. In addition, they can help you share this. They can put it on social media for you. They can do an email campaign or a direct message campaign. They can do a text campaign. You can delegate that to them to send your message out to your audience. You can also have them help you do lead generation. You can do data mining off of LinkedIn or Facebook. You can use Facebook groups to go out there and find more people to talk to. You can build your universe you can make it broader and deeper with the help of a virtual assistant. So a VA can help you with that content creation. They can help you with expanding your audience and getting your message out there. They can also help you figure out how to present things. You need a presentation, a PowerPoint, a Canva. You wanna be able to talk about something at a pitch meeting. You wanna talk about something to investors. You wanna talk about something in front of an audience. You wanna have some kind of visual to go with you. You should be great at telling stories and you shouldn't have to rely on the visuals, but the visuals should back you up. And they should be chock full of data points. You want to talk about how many people you've helped. Me, myself, I've trained over 10,000 people in the Philippines on how to be a good virtual worker. I've trained people on how to do things like look at Facebook and design a social media solution for a client's Facebook page. How to use Facebook insights and analytics to be able to figure out who the right audience is and are you targeting that audience. I've trained virtual assistants on how to do things like edit videos and how to make, make graphics, usually for free, if not cheap, on doing things like CapCut or, or using Canva. So being able to create these visuals, this story, the context that goes with your narrative is important. And then also you want to be consistent, right? You want to drop things on a regular basis. You want to become the Netflix of your business, of your uh, consumers are going to think of when, when are you going to drop your next video? When are you going to drop your next vlog or blog? When are you going to drop your next book? When are you going to do things I can get more of? How do I get more? How do I get notified I'm going to get more? All these things could be handled by a virtual assistant to make sure that you're consistent. Really, as a business owner, you do two things. You create the raw content based on what comes up from up here and in here, and then you're the one talking. You're the one sharing. You're the one out there promoting yourself. And a virtual assistant does all the behind-the-scenes stuff to make you look like you're doing it all. That's the secret to my success. I've been very successful in doing analytics training, data analysis, crunchy numbers, corporate um, training for years. I've been able to be successful also with virtual staffing, getting people like you connected with the virtual assistant because I'm good at telling my story and I just tell a story. I record the raw video, all the effects you see, all the sound effects you hear, all the text things that go across the screen, that's all one of my virtual assistants. I've dropped over 300 videos on YouTube in the last four years. I've written 200 blog posts on Medium, and a lot of that actual work was my idea, but somebody else doing the typing, the editing, and the cutting and pasting. So that's what you want to focus on. Focus on what you do best. Hire somebody else to do all the rest.
That's why I founded Sonic VA, because there was a need from small business owners that I was associated with that wanted to be hooked up with a virtual assistant. So I set up an agency in the Philippines. I spent a big chunk of my time in the Philippines doing training and doing recruiting and networking and building up the brand so that I can give you the best virtual assistants out there. So if you had a bad experience in the past, if you've been burned by a bad virtual assistant, if you're not sure where to start, if you just have a big question mark about what is a virtual assistant, well, we can talk. Regardless of how we do it though, get a hold of me. Feel free to drop a comment below. And if you haven't already done so, please subscribe to the channel. Reach out to me on social media. I'm easy to find on LinkedIn or Facebook or IG. Um, you can look for me in, on IG as a Mighty D. One, you can look me up for me on uh, LinkedIn is the same. Uh, basically, I'm here to help you. And my goal is to connect you with the right talent you need to help you with your data narrative, with a narrative of your business chock full of information. How many customers have you helped? What is your price point? Uh, what are the things you offer and why are they better than everybody else's? What are the things that you can 10X? What are the things that you do better than anybody else? How do you tie that into a narrative, wrap it with some data and present it to people in a way that doesn't take up all your time? That's why we're here. So uh, I hope this video helped. Um, feel free again to drop a comment. Please subscribe. Um, now get out there and have a great day.